Hi there. Quinn with Loom. I'm going to take the next couple minutes to help you understand your workspace a little bit better. Specifically, I want to talk about the difference between your team and personal libraries, go over how to organize content with folders, and talk about sharing and starring videos. So here we are inside of your personal library. This is where videos are recorded when you record a video with Loom. And the personal library is just that. It's personal to you. You can organize this in a way that makes the most sense for you and how you use Loom. You can create folders, you can move videos into those folders, and you can even create folders inside of folders. But what if something that you've created would make more sense to be shared with the entire team? It's really easy to move an individual folder or a video into the team library. Now the team library content is shared with everyone in the workspace. This can be a really valuable place to share FAQs, you know, maybe team meeting updates. Um, one of the things that we do at Loom that I really appreciate is whenever a new person joins the company, they'll record a quick two minute video about themselves and share it to the team library. We have a folder that is all of these intro videos that's just there. So you can go through and watch these videos about the people that you work with every day. Now, what if content doesn't make the most sense to share with everyone on the team? Uh, maybe you created something that's specifically for someone named Jacqueline. If that's the case, what you want to do instead of moving it to the team library is share it with an individual user. And when you click on this share button, you can type in their name or their email. And this will share that content with that individual person and it'll show up in their shared with me section like this. And if anyone shares content with you, it'll show up here for you. This is a really good fit for stuff that's more one-to-one -one or things where you're collaborating on a project with an individual person. So the personal library is again, those videos for you. The team library is for everyone in the workspace and shared with me is where you're gonna see things that people have shared with you specifically. What if you find yourself coming back to individual content frequently and you wanna make sure you don't lose track of it? We have an option to add it to your favorites or hit a little star and that'll make sure that it shows up here in the starred section so you always have access to that content when you need it. Thank you so much for recording with us. I hope that you're having a wonderful day whenever you're watching this.